this is Kishore from <coughs> appsdba.info. In this session, we are going to upgrade uh, Oracle eBusiness, uh, which is running on 12.13 uh, to 12.210. Uh, the database uh, with 12.13 is uh, uh, 12.102, and we are going to upgrade to 19C also eventually. Uh, let me show you my environment. <coughs> so I have uh, a system which is running on 12.13 and the database is 12.102 which is running on 7.x even you can have on 6.x also and uh, the target system is like you know we wanted to upgrade our application from 12.13 to 12.210 and the database we want to upgrade from 12c to 19.12 and uh, 12.210 is only supported on 7.x so this is our uh, this is our environment uh, if you see the high level steps for the upgrade from 12.13 to 12.210, uh, so here are the steps. So as you know, the source is running on 12.13, uh, database is 12.102 and also we have a custom top by name XXERP. Eventually, once we upgrade, we are going to also migrate the custom top. Our target system which is running on 7.x, uh, uh, the <coughs> we have already cloned a 12.13 12c on the new server. So the next step is like we need to install uh, uh, Oracle eBusiness 12.2 in an upgrade mode. Then we have to upgrade from 12.13 to 12.2 using the American driver. Again, we need to uh, configure the 12.2 uh, in an upgrade mode, but this time we have to select the configure mode. We have to enable the online patching. Then we need to uh, do the application upgrade from 12.2 to 12.210. Then we need to do a database upgrade from 12C to 19C. So these are the uh, high level steps uh, uh, for our uh, complete upgrade process. So I have a 12.13 with uh, 12.102 uh, database and uh, what we have to see is we have to see that all of these patches are been applied. Uh, you know, you can just verify. I have basically referred all these three nodes based on that, uh, you know, uh, all these patches have been <coughs> displayed for you. Uh, so you can start the application and also you can verify that you are on 12.13 with 12C database. If you see that I just started my uh, database, it's a cloned instance so for my test purpose. <coughs> if you want the dump, I can you can always request me and I can forward. It's around 20-25 GB. Uh, I can put it in the uh, drive, uh, Google Drive, and you can you can download it. So if you see the, this is the 12.102 and 12.13. Uh, 12.13 applications. So the next step what we have to do is we have to install 12.2 uh, uh, in an upgrade mode which we'll be seeing in our uh, next session. So in this current session I just gave you, I gave you an overview about my you know environment. If you have seen my uh, environment, my environment is uh, I just cloned an instance uh, on to a uh, uh, <coughs> uh, on which is running on 7.x which is 12.13 and 12.102 the target is we have to upgrade our Oracle applications to 12.210 uh, and the database we want to upgrade to 19.12 so operating system yeah 7.x is supported for Oracle eBusiness 12.210 so and here are the high level steps for the you know upgrade first we have cloned on the new server uh, then um, we have installed. We'll, we have to install 12.2 uh, in an upgrade mode. Then upgrade 12.13 to 12.2. Then we need to install 12.2 in a configuration mode. Enable the online patching. Application upgrade from 12.2 to 12.2. And database upgrade from 12C to 19C. These are the high level steps. And uh, you know uh, you have to see that all of these patches are been applied. Uh, I've just basically referred these particular nodes and and I, I have pasted all the patches that are required. So in my case, uh, the assumption is uh, that we have a 12102 with 12132 uh, 12 application and 12102 database, and we'll proceed. Uh, uh, you know, we'll proceed with the Oracle eBusiness 12.2 in an upgrade mode. We'll do the installation on a, a new home. So let's catch up in the next session. Thank you for watching.